Hello and welcome. Welcome if you are new here and welcome back if you've been with me for a while. I really do appreciate you all. Today I have for you another unboxing because you know, what else do I do around these parts? It's called Fire and Nice. So this is new to me. So obviously I don't know how much it costs. It'll be on the screen. Don't forget I have a giveaway going on. That's linked down below. Also, there is other information down there. So uh, let's get into this. So I don't even remember what this box is supposed to be about. I looked at it for months and uh, I finally decided to get it. So I don't know, I open it up and this is what I see. And then it says, hello, August. Let's see. Welcome to the Fire and Nice subscription box. Hello, this month we have put together some artisan handcrafted self-care products in a fun fruit theme. We hope you enjoy. It says in the large boxes, so maybe this is the large box, you can enjoy and then it tells me what I can enjoy, but they don't have prices or anything. So, let's see. So again, this is what I see. And the first thing I am pulling out is a fresh strawberry hand poured vegan and soy candle. Mmm, it does smell like strawberry and it's just looks like a candle. Oh, that smells really good. It's a little tiny thing. I don't know how many hours that will give you. I wonder how many hours that would give you. But uh, it's made by Purple Vertigo Candles at Etsy. So I suppose I maybe got the larger box. Okay, so the next thing I have, it's in a little Ziploc baggie here. And it says, what does it say? Okay, there we go. So we have a uh, Melon Rose Beauty Toner. And it looks like a nice little travel size. I don't know if you can see, it has like little watermelons floating in there. Uh, let's see. And this is a beauty toner and a makeup setting spray. Spray onto face as needed. So I will spray it in my hand. And it doesn't really, it smells more like rose than melon. Um, and it kind of has an oily consistency. Uh, I don't know, we'll see about that. Okay, let's see, the next thing I am pulling out is a watermelon scented lip balm. I am filming at a different time today. It's kind of early, I woke up kind of early. And that's what it looks like, and I do not think that it smells like watermelon. It's, it smells like beeswax. Maybe it has like a hint of watermelon in it, but I don't know. So, I mean, I can always use a lip balm, so that's cool. The next thing I am pulling out is kiwi watermelon soap. And, mm, I mean, uh, I usually don't like soaps that are made with glycerin and it kind of looks, let me see. Yeah, glycerin. And I can't smell it through here, but um, I don't know. Maybe it's a good travel soap, I don't know. I can't. I wish I could smell it through the packaging. Okay, let's see, the next thing, oh, that's cute. And the next, and maybe it looks like the last thing I am pulling out is a bath bomb. That's really cute. And that does smell like watermelon, so that smells good. That's super, super cute. Okay, so I am assuming that I do have the large box that I did buy the large box, but that smells really good. Okay, so, since I don't remember how much this box is, I don't know if this is worth it 
<laughs> but I will put it on the screen if I feel like it was worth the price once I figure out what the price is. Uh, so we got a bath bomb, we got a soap, we got a candle, a lip balm, and a face toner, makeup setting spray. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I'll probably get use out of everything except for maybe this. So, I don't know. We'll get it for a couple more months and see. I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. Have a great day. Bye.